Hey, what is going on guys? Extra Fusion here, and today we are playing the Call of Duty World War II campaign. I'm really fucking excited for this. I have not played anything of it yet. I've seen it's pretty freaking good, um, from what I've heard at least. So uh, it's the deadly deadliest conflict in human history. I'm really excited for this. Um, I haven't seen any gameplay, I haven't seen any cutscenes, I haven't seen anything. I don't know anything about it other than what I've seen in the trailers, so that's exciting. And uh, yeah, I play the campaigns every year, I enjoy them every year, except for Black Ops 3. Black Ops 3 was just, that campaign was so bad, I, I can't even explain how bad Black Ops 3's campaign was. Uh, people have told, tried to tell me that that was a good campaign. I just, no, I don't know. It was just, it didn't follow the Black Ops story at all. It didn't, it just wasn't enjoyable even. It just wasn't, it wasn't good, honestly. Uh, Infinite Warfare, surprisingly, had a pretty good campaign, though, so. I'm excited to play this one, though. It looks really freaking good. This day set upon a mighty Here we go, D-Day. I believe... Is this going to be the first mission? Probably. Kind of the main thing they were focusing on in the trailer. This looks so badass. Wow, that is awesome. <sighs> Favorite campaign of all time? It's gotta be Call. Modern Oops, Warfare 3. 1944. Maybe Black Ops 2. I don't know. This, so let's hope this one beats it. Beach, Maybe Black Ops 1, even though it's a pretty good campaign. Also, we can take back or MW2. Mountain. But wait, you're gonna have to battle. I made some good buddies in basic, and they're all on the boat with me. Everybody's scared Style of the world letting off. Yellow. I hated Zussman the first week of basic, but now he's probably the best friend I have in the world. He's always looking for trouble. If there wasn't already a war on, he'd be off trying to start one. Guys, I gotta keep all my fingers. I'm gonna take photo of the year. Styles says he's gonna be a photographer for Life magazine. Kinda looks like Clark Kent, except when he takes off his glasses, the only thing that happens is he can't see shit. Aello's the vet, but being honest, he's what Ma would call a bit of a rude. Okay. Let's make this more interesting. St. Michael, patron saint of soldiers. He's at my back from Kessler. Press him a few times in ten seconds. That'll be all he is. Is that Javier from the Walking oh, Dead Telltale games? Kind of sounds like I'm him a little bit. Okay. Just a little bit. I'm in. Can't watch. Just time me when I tell you. Back to my story. What me and doing? my boys, we muscle our way into this poker game with the football game. We work out a system where they can signal to me everybody's hand. Do you share this scheme or choose me straight? Stop pop. You ready? That's what happens when you try to hustle a hustler. Now. Oh, God. They did this game back then? Hello had enough fight in him for two men. I said never shake hands with you. That's not what you said last night. And enough bigotry for six. Yeah, let me just keep pretending anyway. Apparently you did. I'm gonna give him something better. A real short for this shit. Good luck with that. Oh! Read from the 1800s, we're gonna be late. It's like a movie. I got us covered, Daniel. Briefings about to start. It's got really good. Then there's Sergeant Pierce. Pierce. It's got really good uh, graphics. You think you're special, huh? The crowds are gonna eat your lunch. And not our lunch, Sergeant. Our lunch is secure. Watch your lips, Justin. On me. Since I'm obviously on a lucky streak, whatever happens, stay close. First Normandy, then the Rhine. We got this, Daniel. That's our guy, Daniels. He's a farm boy dude from uh, Texas, I think. 
Today, with our allies, we embark on an operation of unparalleled importance to establish a beachhead at Normandy and roll back the German aggression that has terrorized Europe for the past five years. We are all that separates the world from darkness. This Oh, this is hype. Much more than a chance to be heroes in our own lifetime. If we prevail, our triumph will be etched in the hearts and minds of a grateful world. It's a good actor right there. Generation. He's in lots of movies and TV about shows. Glory, gentlemen. That I've seen. True glory. That's our guy. Colonel Davis sure can give a nice speech. His pep talk reminded me of the one Coach Johnson gave us on our Thanksgiving Day game versus Austin. I'm sure you remember we lost that game by 42 points. Who's he talking to? He talking to like Always a girlfriend or something? Shoulders, Lieutenant Turner. Me relating a letter, a letter to her. Tight leash, but if Pearson breaks free, we'll all get bit. This must be fucking frightening to be on that, honestly. Yeah, he's writing a letter. You've always been a tough act to follow. Paul? Is that a son? Sure gonna try. Maybe brother or something. I don't, know. I don't think he doesn't look old enough to have a son. He seems pretty young. So. It's now or never. Oh, that's a girl. Hey, I wish I was coming home to her. Yeah, just wait till we hit Paris. Seems like a long way off. Remember, no digging in at the shore. You've got to advance. You need to stay low and do not bunch up. You stick to your training, you're going to make it through. I'm proud to lead you fellas in the battle. Anytime, anywhere. All right, give him time. D-Day, June 19th. Or June 6th. 1944. Don't scare, Private. This no, is exciting. You should be. A lot of research went into this line? game. I, I give them the sure props because it's very realistic to real World War II. People say, oh, multiplayer is not historically accurate. Oh, that guy got fucking popped. But uh, yeah, multiplayer obviously is not meant to be historically accurate, but in a game mode like this. Campaign, it's gotta be, and it is, so that's exciting. Dude, if I was that guy right there, I'd be freaking out. He's the one, he's the highest, he's the highest at everybody. I'd want the lowest possible spot on this boat as possible. They all got like bags over there, I'm on grants. I guess keep the rain off of it. Holy shit, keep them nice and dry. Wet guns aren't. Too functionable, especially the older guns. Guns nowadays can function water pretty well, though. They made them more waterproof. Back then, though, they didn't. They weren't waterproof. Oh boy, that was probably not a good idea. Ooh. And this was in the trailer, they all get popped. Holy shit. Dude, this is incredible. Their fucking heads just getting exploded. Just the MG turrets that they're getting shot at by. Dude, this is this is giving me the chills. Take a bag of and get to the seawall. Daniels, this is what you trained for. Now pick up that banger. Holy you can fuck. do this! Yes, sir! Oh, Jesus. Alright. Let's 
do this. So we're playing on regular, not recruit, not hardened. Get some goddamn cover. Alright, so where are we going exactly? I know the health system is different in this game, which is interesting. We gotta reach the seawall. Oh god, oh! Hit the deck, hit the deck, hit the deck! And we don't regain health, we just have to um, get a med pack from a teammate, but... I don't know if we have that right now. Go, 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 go! So scared. I mean, I would be too, honestly. Fire the hole. Holy shit. Oh god, they're just getting smoked. Had the heal. That's that's awesome. Oh, move, moves up and move. All right, here we go. That's pretty awesome. Oh, and you can find med kits around the map, I guess. Oh. Core 98k with iron sights, that's dope. Oh, there's leaning? In campaign? That's dope. Of course, there was leaning in multiplayer. I like leaning. Eliminate enemies to earn squad abilities. Oh, so you can only get the squad abilities when you get more uh, kills. Oh boy. Just gonna run through here? Alright. Let's do it. like the war mission. Oh, just like real life too. Fuck. We're getting pretty low on health. Yeah, I need that first aid kit like now. I like the gore and the blood, it's beautiful. What the hell just happened there? Oh, I love that, you can just pass at me like that, that's dope.
I didn't know the team. <laughs> I would be so bad in war, man. Throw grenades. Boom. That table like blowing up like I can do something. Oh, I trade on my ammo grand. Fuck. Oh, that's awesome. It's such a little feature that I actually. It's such a little feature that I really like. The fact that you could just kick down that table like a badass. I don't know why. There's little things that just make games better. It's the little things. Clear out this next place. First aid kit over here. Artillery is hitting the beach. Next assault way, make it a make it. Move up. That artillery is killing us. Yes, sir. Grenade out. It's like lag, it's like the frame rate's dropping it right now and then. I don't know why. You guys see that? Oh, I thought that was our another team. Or the enemy. I'm going in. Oh yes. Oh, I'm dying by my own flames. I saw people freaking out because the PBSH is in a German gun, but they did. Germans did pick up uh, Russian weapons during the battle. They did. Like during previous battles. Use some help. You have what you need, pal. That is true, I do. Killed my teammate. The hell are they doing? Oh, I'm gonna do a telescope. Oh, can we please do a breach? I love breaches in COD. I want to do a, please be a slow-mo breach. Please be a small, please be slow-mo. Please be slow-mo. I love slow-mo breaches. Oh, never mind. Slow-mo breaches in Call of Duty campaigns are, oh, are lit as fuck. Shot from. Oh, up there! Shit! Did I just get two hit markers on them? I did. Move it up. Here we go. Is the Car 98 literally the only gun they have? Are we running in? Oh. 
Oh, get him. Fucking get this guy! No! Damn, so that's the medic, too. He's gonna live. He'll be alright. Oh, this is that. Part of the thing. Bash his head. Yes. I'll do it a few more times just for hell. Come here, buddy. I can't walk. Oh shit. Get me the fuck out of here. Oh shit. Stay with me. What are we bringing? We've got to get over to that CCP! Ah, on your left! Ah. I'm out! Oh shit. Ah. Ah, we gotta take cover! Probably safer in the trenches. Ah, keep your head down. Can you get them? They keep coming. Shit. Watch out. <laughs> oh shit. He's down. Let's move. Hang on. Those girls in Paris are waiting for you. Uh, really? Of course they are. I, I, how about, how about another look at your girl? Huh? Huh? Uh, you kidding me? It's okay. I can't, I can't see shit. I'm just, uh, we're in a rest right here. No, no, no. You have to stay awake. Hey, Daniels, I'm here. Help me. I need a goddamn medic! Damn, this is pretty fucking crazy. I got this! Go! Here, take care of it. I need you with me, Daniels. Listen up! There's a GPS cannon by the farmhouse up the road. It's tearing up the beach. Let's move! We'll come back for you. Check your ammo and grenades. You heard them. Move it up! Ammo when you're ready, Brad. Sir, ready for ammo. Oh, this guy gives me ammo? Weird. Yeah. Turner. Yeah, Zussman, Daniels, Turner. When we get to the farmhouse, be ready to engage. Move fast! They're shelling that beach to shit! Oh, look at that shot.
I don't have med kits anymore. Oh, I do. Never mind. I have two left, though. After that, I don't think I get any more. Is us men ain't here? What the fuck just happened? When we get to the farmhouse, I don't ready know. Ready Move fast. Throw the grenade. Lob the smoke grenade. the MG up here. Yes. Ammo when you're ready, Dude, how are we gonna defend this? There's so many. Our tank? Yeah, it's ours. Never mind. We good. <sighs> Let's destroy this shit together, boy. We got the MG42 in our hands now? Word. Back here, or back together somewhere. Daniel, I'll go see him. He's gonna be all right. What you did back there, I owe you. I say we're even. We'll see this through. To the end. To the end. Beachhead secured. Bivouac at the second hedgerow after the ridge. Welcome to the bloody first. You're a long way from Texas, my boy. Well, that's funny. He was holding a grease gun in the trailer. I was holding a uh, Tommy gun. None of us could have prepared for this. But you came through when it counted. Thanks, sir. I, uh... You'll be all right, sir. Thank you. Yes, sir. Of course I will. Damn. And that's just the first mission. I don't know who the hell decided this was the best way to retake Europe, but I'll guarantee you one thing. They weren't going to be plus this one. Wow. After action four. I don't know who the hell decided this is the best way to retake Europe. They weren't but Alright, continue. I guess it's going on to the next mission, maybe? Uh, no, it doesn't. I like that. It doesn't just go back to the next mission right away. I hate when Call of Duty's do that, when they just go to the next mission. I'm like, dude, can't you just let me choose if I want to go to the next mission or not? 
But um, all right. So next mission is Operation Cobra, which is July twenty fifth, nineteen forty four. A uh, kind of like a month later. Kind of look ahead a little bit. It kind of just follows through the European theater of this time period. And uh, oh, that's cool how it shows you on the map where they are. So that's when they hit Normandy, and now they're moving to the. Um, I believe is that to the south? I think that's south, right? Whatever, they're moving through that area. But um Yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the first one. Oh what is this? Mementos? I get items, like collectibles I guess. Um yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the first mission of the campaign and I'll see you guys on my next one. And uh Peace out.